Yo, what up guys? This is Kutta, and this is going to be the KQS method on how to fix your lag spikes in gaming. So first off, what you're going to do is that you're going to go to the administration. You're going to go to system and you want to make sure you have enabled JFFS custom scripts and configs. Make sure that is yes. Then come down here. Make sure you enable your SSH. Make sure you have that to LAN only. And that would make sure that you're able to connect to your router. So once you're done with all that, you can open up PuTTY. All right, so once you're in PuTTY, just type in your default gateway address. And my port is 25 because I said it's 25. All right, now with money open, what you're going to do is that you're going to log in. And once you're logged in, you're going to copy and paste this script. All right, once you have it in, you're gonna, what you're going to do is you're going to press enter. And then it will start installing and restarting the QoS. And that should be it right there. Now you don't have to use PuTTY anymore. All right, so go back to adaptive QoS and then come to the KQoS Merlin tab. And this should be pretty straightforward because I don't have to really uh, type anything for you guys. I'm just gonna show you what I have. So basically on the priority queue tinned, you want the download to be diff serve a and upload diff serve four. The flow isolation fairness, you want the download to be dual host DST host and upload is dual SRC host. And you want NAT lookup on yes on both download and upload. You want wash DSCP markings on download only not upload. Filter duplicate TCP acts no on both. And then in the custom download parameters, you're gonna put RTT 300 MS. And you're gonna do the same for the custom upload parameters too. And then once you finish there, you're gonna hit apply. And then from there, that's it. You don't have to set up anything. That's just basically a plug and play type thing. And that should be it. Just uh, leave a like and subscribe.